props, man. I thought you were gonna go the distance. I, I thought it was about to go. Um, with like one the of distance. the best fighters in New Zealand, Gunnar the Stunner. Yep. What, tell me what you're feeling right now. Um, tired. I'm glad that I went to the fifth round. Are you proud of yourself? I am. I am. Because I jokingly said, oh, you know, give him a good round, I get paid. But I took it a bit more seriously. I had a good backing, had good fitness, had a good camp, and gave him a push. Gave him a blood nose. That's my main majority decision to uh, take some of the distance, lead them up a little bit, give them a give them a sweat. But how do you feel you did? Like, you know, he's he's one of the top in New Zealand. How do you feel you did against one of the, you know, one of the best? I feel like I went enough of the distance and um, short notice. It, it brought out respect in me and, and assess how I go in boxing. And to go up against one of the best, it, um, it gives me a bit of confidence, but it also gives me a bit of humility. So I'm yeah, I'm all for helping his record. It's not going to really help his record if he doesn't stop me. So I'm okay with him doing the business. It's not good for him to um, yeah just sort of let me go through. Were you happy with your stamina? I mean, you did pretty well. I mean, you were exchanging, and almost like you were. It was it was not a one-sided fight. You I were... was a couple of. It got a bit messy sometimes. A couple of shots fell into place. Um, I felt him grabbing. That's the sign that I feel a bit more confident when he starts grabbing a bit more he's not comfortable with what I'm doing and I'm pushing him a bit until I give him a blood nose and once I see that blood I've done my job so the routine you do before you know on the bike it really shows right it sure shows out there right yeah so yeah. I don't feel like I guess too the much second in there. Win. Yeah. and um, yeah the second one kicked in and um, was able to focus focus on a bit of game plan listen to my corner hopefully show a bit of quality and put on a show for the night to um, look forward to the last Fight. Can you t talk to me about the the, the the fifth round though? What happened in the, you know, what, what did you see? Um... I I didn't see anything. I felt like there was a minute to go. I took the foot off the pedal. I might have lost a bit of concentration and something tagged me. Because there was one punch I saw, a swing. Yeah. And then from then it just sort of, you just put your hands up and you went into defense mode. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I felt like, um, yeah, I saw stars for a half second. I started recovering. I had recovered by the time he stepped in, but I, because I was stepping back, I'm more of a forward fighter. It, it shows, it, it's a weird thing when I'm stepping back. And because, so I kind of shot myself in the foot because I'm normally a forward fighter. If I'm going back, it's because there's a problem. Was it the first time you experienced something like that? In more a long likely, time? Yeah, because I kind of woke up in the ring. I kind of felt like a minute to go, foot off the pedal, I can, I can just coast to the finish line, listen to my corner to just, just finish the round nicely, but I totally believe it's better for him to um, get a stoppage for his record. And for your record, it does really well, right? I mean, going to Stanley Jackson, for my number two, fight. Yeah, pro for my fight. So. Were you happy with that? Oh, I was. Ha I'm so proud of him. Yeah, yeah, me too, man. Yeah. That was hear, I'm hearing a lot, a lot of people around are saying we didn't expect that much of a quality from Kendall being his second fight, and he really did bring it to a gunner. And it's, I'm just proud. Kendall, um, last word for your fans out there, and do you know you know how you end the interview with the punch at the camera? Just do your thing, man. Oh, can just finish it. No, Give a last word to your fans um, out there, because I'm sure it's right. foot forward. I've got so many quotes that I could bubble off, bubble off. Um, yeah, just put your best foot forward. You never know what's going to happen, and um, so you yeah, people, people respect that. You did well, man. Really well. Yeah. Congrats, man. Thank you. Thanks for letting me be a part of that, man. Cool. Welcome. Anytime. I if you've got it. something else for you, if you want me to cut in, if you've got something else, uh, a plug for, if you want me to say Glad Rat more, or like if I say, I can't wait to see this on Glad Rat later. But if you think of something, I'm open to you being just, your puppet. You just did it, so thanks, man. I thanks, know you're man. not the Illuminati, but like, <laughs> hey, I am easily manipulated by cash, money, what? Nice, nice. Thanks, Benji.